Burn in hell. Well, it has happened yet again, unfortunately, another racist post on social media, this one filled with racial slurs directed at African Americans. And yet again, it involves students within the Clark County School District. Now, this is just unfortunately the latest in a string of highly offensive racial issues that have now cropped up within the district. And 13 investigative reporter Joe Bartels is live at Palo Verde High School near Olton Town Center Drive with the details that are just coming out tonight, Joe. Well, Tom, Trisha, the video was posted on Snapchat, but it really started making the rounds last night and several people did report it to the district's Safe Voice app. Then the principal sent a message out to all parents condemning the posting, the video and the language that was used in it. Burn in hell. There's a part. I'll slap that as well. Why? Need to learn. It's unclear where the video was shot or when it was recorded. The school district does say it was not recorded on campus, though. The student in the video appears to be reciting lyrics to a song. The school district did tweet about the video, saying Palo Verde High School is aware of the video and is investigating. Behavior like this will not be tolerated at our school nor anywhere in the Clark County School District. We spoke to a parent who happens to be running for city council who says even though the video appears to be linked to a song, it's still very offensive. It doesn't matter. You should have enough sense because guess what? There's going to be a song that says something very disparaging about him or something that he's closely related to that he'll find offensive. This comes on the heels of a racist firestorm at Arborview High School where some students post about cleansing the halls of African-American students and a desire for a Columbine style shooting part two. Just weeks later, trustee Danielle Ford inflamed race relations after she referred to some students as colored. That sent parents storming out of a school board meeting back here at Palo Verde High School. The principal again sent out a message, uh, but saying that there was no specific threat to the school or to uh, any students. And it's unclear what, if anything, will happen to the students involved in that video. Reporting live, Joe Bartels, 13 Action News.